You know what I mean? Yeah, um, just trying to dodge the beam. Yeah, I'd like to start this vlog with an apology. Uh, I'm exactly a month late with this one. But what are you doing? My original plan was to get a vlog out on the first of the month, every month. Um, first two were okay, third one, not so much. But I'm hoping that when you see the vlog, you'll see why I'm so far behind. I don't keep track of time. Well, no. I mean, how busy was October? Can you remember where we went? See, yep. it's been yep. so busy, Hillhead. Charlie can't even remember. Hillhead Ludlow. Yeah. Love to stay. Love to stay. How did I forget that? I don't know, yeah. Um, if you're thinking of love to stay, what's the first thing you remember about love to stay? Kayaking. No, hot tubs. The, the, yeah, yeah. Um, anyway, we'll, we'll come to that in a minute. Ow! Um, another reason that we've been so far behind is we stood in the project caravan that Charlie and I have. Can you remember what it is? What year it is? Bailey Ricardo, 1966? 67, but close Whoa. enough. Yeah, Charlie stood in a ladder. And he uh, shot. Um, so yeah, every time that we've been trying to get this thing finished, uh, if we've had a spare hour, we've been out here uh, beavering away. Because we're trying to get it ready for next year, but not at any point next year, February of next year. Which um, yeah, seems a bit of a tall order at the moment, doesn't it? Month after my birthday. Month after Charlie's birthday. Um, oh. As I was saying before my phone rang, yeah, it's been busy in October and November. And here are some of the things that we've been doing. The first trip to Love to Stay in October was for the Caravan Writers Guild workshop. There's more of Love to Stay coming up in this vlog, but there's going to be even more at a later date because I've got so much content, I'll do a separate video. From Love to Stay, I visited the Caravan and Motor Home Club's Moorhampton site, followed by the Old Orchard, which is a phenomenal CL site. From the Old Orchard, I visited Bromyard Downs, closely followed by Brampton Golf Club, which is a CL that's set right on a golf course. Shortly before the NEC show, Charlie and I uh, went clay shooting on a very wet day, and then it was up to Birmingham for the NEC show itself. We're watching you up there thinking, oh my god, can I pass that crowd? Yes. Standing room only. Yes. And we've got to follow you. <laughs> <laughs> what? This is your oh, what crowd. What an act to follow. It's, it's your crowd, isn't it? Well, yeah. yeah. They're here because yeah. they want to be. Yeah, but having watched you and them, <laughs> I think it's very much your crowd. They love you in this. Well. I think they loved your bottle of Cardi as well. I think so. Yeah. I think that's probably more to it. <laughs> so what are you doing now? Uh, we took um, two caravans of motorhome 300 kilometres inside the Arctic Circle Whoa. in the middle of a Finnish winter. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're going to be talking about Talk it? Talking about that. Yeah. Two on, one seat. Yeah. Snuggle up. Take us know. back to the let's Arctic. Let's face it. I was yeah. going to say, let's face it, you've been more snug. Yeah. yeah. You're, you're right. a bit more close There's now no as well. Now, Lee, no, no, no none at all. Yeah. There weren't many secrets then. So I want you to come out and I want you to say, hello, I'm Lee and I'm Simon and together we are Lee and Simon. <laughs> okay, everybody, right, what we're going to do now is uh, bring on a couple of uh, chaps who uh, went on an expedition of epic proportions and uh, they took uh, some Bailey caravans and a motorhome, I think. But we'll find out in a minute. And they went <coughs> to the Arctic. So if you buy yourself a van today, or a caravan, or maybe even a tent, maybe that's what you could decide to do. Some people might go to Cornwall, some people might go to Scotland, some people might go to Norfolk, some people might go to Spain. But these guys went to the Arctic Circle. So please welcome uh, from Bailey, he's the uh, marketing director, Simon Howard, and journalist and general caravan lover, Lee Davy. My friends had to figure it out. Yeah, they saw us as I do. We tried hard and they never knew. Come in, come in. Come in, let me write. 
How are you? Take a seat. Right, okay. So, um, yeah, you guys are like hardcore caravanners now, is that right? Well, we like to think we were anyway, but uh, even harder now we've been to the Arctic, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together for Simon and for Lee and for Bailey. Thank you so much. Right, okay. Past 50. You beat me, Charlie. 10 seconds to go. Let's get to 100. 100. Let's get to 150. 130. Well done. Right, this could be a very bad idea. Um, I've brought Charlie into the Unicorn Segovia, um, let him in with his eyes shut. He hasn't seen it yet. Just to see what his first impressions are of this six birth family unicorn. Right, okay, open uh, your eyes. This is bright. Okay, so we are in the middle washroom. Is What's this only the middle? This is huge. And then we have the bunks at the back. If I squeeze past you. So what do you reckon of the bedding area, Charlie? Good. Lights. Give us space. Yeah, so you'd have your own um, seating area at the back. Yeah. So you can charge your phone. Oh, okay. There. Yeah, yeah. Um, there. Is there one at the top as well? Yeah, there is. Yeah. Um, um, you could. There's this if you wanted to put your electrical cool. things in there. Shall we have a look at the lounge as well? Yeah. So we've got the middle washroom and the bunks. Do you like that? Yeah. I like to sit down. Oh yeah. That over there. What do you reckon, Charlie? Here, have you seen the fridge? No, where? Just here. Yeah. How big is that? How? <laughs> <laughs> How comfy is that front lounge compared to our pursuit? Oh, nice. Do you like it? I think it could have been a mistake bringing Charlie in one of these. No. So there's a kitchen. Bye. Bye. I'm staying here. Are you staying here, are you? Yes. Right, so Charlie and I, we've bought some British Army ration packs for the father-son part of our trip. You've um, opened yours. We've already opened mine. So what's in yours, Charlie? I've got loads of stuff in here. Okay. I've got matches for some reason. Yeah, you're not having them, okay? No, you can have them. Okay. I don't want them either. Um, I've got coffee. You can have that. Okay. You can have that. Yeah, yeah. You can have tea. Tea bags? No. Yeah. The Typhoo? Yeah. Okay, yeah. Um, yeah. A have spork. You... Cool. In... Oh, some more coffee. Um, I've had these before. A cinnamon bar. Okay, let's have a look. Oh, sesame seed bar? Yeah. Okay. Some tissues like you have. Yeah. Um, Is that mix. nougat? Nougat? Yeah, new, uh, mixed dried fruit nougat bar. Nice. Bar. Smooth peanut butter. <laughs> okay. Um, a fruit flavoured energy drink powder. Yeah, you're not having that. I'll have that I can... another day. Um, yeah, I can just imagine you're an energy drink. Um, tutti frutti flavoured drink powder with sugar and sweeteners. Ooh. <laughs> Instant hot chocolate. Oh, nice. Should we have that in a minute? No, you've got your own. Yeah, you can have yours. I'll have mine. Success. Cola flavoured drink powder with sugar and sweeteners. Nice. Peanuts. Roast Hang on, this. Is that solid? Yeah, I think vacuumed. Oh yeah, look at them. It's vacuum. I think all the air's been vacuumed out. I reckon you're right. Um, oh, What's that? digestive biscuits. Oh. Mine. Dunk in your hot chocolate. Um, beyond the, 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 the so plain rice. Oh, plain rice. Okay. So what's to go with your plain rice? I'm just having a chocolate pudding and chocolate sauce. Nice. Oh, beef goulash. Oh. Good work. Chicken and vegetable soup. Nice. All day breakfast. 
So straight from the NEC show, Charlie and I headed to Love to Stay for my second visit of the month. So this could be a bad idea, we're in the change rooms at Love to Stay. Um, this is October, outside temperature is 10 degrees. Um, Charlie and I are about going swimming. Good luck, mate. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Whose idea was this? Yours? That was yours? Am I? You sure? Oh my! Oh. You ready? Yeah, go on then. <laughs> no, you're in. You're in. I don't know. Hey. <laughs> you ready? Jump. Ready? Yeah, sure. Yeah, go. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Come towards you. Go, 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 From Love to Stay, we headed south to Ludlow Touring Park. What are we doing, Charlie? So we've got to weave out of, in and out of those poles and swings. Yep. We've got to climb up that wood board, go across the monkey bars, and get to the end, the fastest time wins. So as soon as you get to the end of the monkey bars, that's it, it stops? Um, I thought, um, yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah, you can't be touching the monkey bars. I'll tell you what, how about last monkey bar, as soon as you're on the last monkey bar, drop. When your feet hit the floor, I'll stop the stopwatch. When your feet hit the bar. Okay, mate. You ready? Yeah. You steady? Yeah. Go. I don't think I'm going to beat this time. Oh, yeah. 1557. Yes. On your marks, get set, go. You're not allowed to touch the floor, monkey bars. Huh? So Charlie and I are getting ready for uh, Helen's birthday. Um, we've bought some birthday banners. You might be able to see it's got 21st written on there. Yeah, it's all Sainsbury's had, but uh, you know, hopefully she'll like that. A uh, little tour around. Charlie's busy up here making a card. How's it going, Charlie? Good. And we also have some flowers that I'll I don't know, try and wrap somehow. You and a tiny bit around it. I do. And um bought a bottle of Prosecco as well. Mine. Plus it's mine. Bought the Prosecco, yeah, I think not me. Um surprise gift as well. So hopefully we've outdone ourselves. One, two, no, don't do that. Three, four, five, yes! twenty, thirty, forty, forty-nine, fifty. <laughs> After Helen's birthday, I visited Huck's Barn Farm, which is a fantastic CL site. Uh, just a 20 minute walk from the centre of Ludlow. From Huck's Barn Farm, I visited the Caravan Club's AGM, which was held at the National Motorcycle Museum in Coventry. As it was time to go in, there was a fantastic wedding being held outside. So 
Charlie and I are staying at Hillhead. Um, this is not Hillhead behind us, but it's actually Paynton Zoo. It's about a five, ten minute drive from the site. Um, what do you reckon? Good. It's really interesting. Uh, the site itself is great for children. Uh, Lots of space to run around and good equipment. Oh, the play pups crack in. There's also a bar as well, uh, which is a bonus because when you've had a busy day, you can stop and have a quick pint. And then I can go in the arcade. And there's an arcade as well. So we've gone from ration pack to fish. To a fish. The final sites we visited were Great Prado Farm, which is a CL site, as is Smallcombe Farm. Poppy and I also did the rocket race, which is an eight kilometer run with 30 obstacles. I won't put too much in this vlog. I'll probably use it for a separate video because I mean, you've watched this much already. Who needs to see a 47 year old middle-aged man huffing and puffing around a terribly difficult course? Oh, good. Cool. Yeah, what well on pop. Well